So let's get into mod making for the official Venge IO client. First of all, you want to open up your official Venge client. Come to settings, client, enable Venge.io mod. Your client will reload. You want to close it. Come to your documents, Venge client, resource swapper, and this is where you will drop your mods. Now, by default, the game has a whole bunch of like numbered folders. Um, it's really horrible, terrible way to do things. So what I would really suggest is everybody come to Roro's Venge mod server, grab the valid system. This took a few days to put together. But what this does is it's a complete and utter rewrite of the official mod system. This is completely default files, so all you're going to have to do is edit the files in each of these folders. All you want to do is go to download zip, save. Now it is around 40 megabytes, I believe. No, 35.6, close enough. <laughs> what we want to do is just make sure you have WinRAR or 7-Zip or a program like this. Simply click to open it. And you only want the files and config.json. Click and drag those into your resource hopper. And you, you're done. You can literally... Come into your files, assets, abilities, character. So let's say weapon. Here's the shotgun, here's the scar, here's the M4 pistol. Let's have a look at the scar texture. So the normal scar texture is scar defuse. We're just going to quickly hue shift that to show you what it would be in game. How simple it is. Give that a save. Open our game. Boom. There you go. There's one pink scar. And if we go in game. There you go. There is your customized skin. I will be doing a follow-up video for anybody who wants to customize the actual model of your scar. That will require a different thing, uh, not your weapon scar Jace on here. We will need to have a GLB, so stay tuned for the next video for that.